Hi guys, welcome. My name is Amit and today I am here to talk about VLOOKUP that is a very important formula in Excel and it is actually very useful. So what is this VLOOKUP? Uh, let's, uh, I'll tell you by an example. Suppose we are in a company, we work for a company and uh, there are so many teams like team 1 to team 20 when there are so many teams working in the company and we have a data of the company like how much pen book file paper and pencils were used in a year by these teams so i mean someone asked us to give the data data for some selected teams so you can see here the teams are not in uh, even format like here and it are uneven and the, there are some different numbers it's not in an order i mean to say so if it is not in an order and so since the teams are not in order and uh, if we have to get the details only of these teams like team 1, team 3, team 5 uh, we want the details of how much pen and file were uh, I mean this company, these teams used in a year so how to use that so uh, VLOOKUP plays a very important role to find out uh, I'll tell you how so every formula in Excel starts with equal to so equal to VLOOKUP so you can see once we V L O O K U P. So just double click here, and I'll tell you one thing that you don't have to remember the formula or I mean the steps how to do this because once you type this, you can see the formula itself written over here. You can you have to just follow whatever written here, uh, whatever is written here. You can see now the highlighted part is lookup value. So what value we are looking for? We are looking for the value for team one. So select team one here once you do that you can see you have taken the lookup value you can see next is comma put a comma and once you do that you can see the table array is now highlighted it has been it is in a bold letter now so what is this table array table array is nothing but the data from where we have to fetch our details so the table array is this whole thing just select all the thing and once you do that once you select this you can see the data has been taken so table array you have selected put a comma and the next is column index number so what is column index number column index number is I'll tell you see wherever your data starts from that will be the number one so data starts from team like team is one pen is two book is three it has now I have written this to uh, make you understand so where from wherever your data starts that will be the point one so we are looking for the data of pen so pen is uh, on the second location second number team is one and pen is two so next will be two you have to after giving the comma you have to write two and again comma you can see the range lookup now uh, for true it is approximate match and false it's, it is exact exact match so we want the exact match so we have to click false you can double click on the false or else I'll tell you a true means 1 and false is 0 so if you type here 0 and give a enter you can see your the data you have the data of this thing so what next do you the you might be thinking like we will have to do the same thing for everything no once you do that you don't have to do anything you can see uh, a box sh a shape symbol at the uh, corner of the cell just select this and drag it down and you can see all the details have automatically come here you have uh, all the values for these teams you can verify or let's verify for team 13 it says as 100 we'll go here and check it for team 13 and how much pen they have used it's 100 it's very easy and very simple it, it almost saves all of your time so now we'll try the same thing for a file what about file again the formula starts with v look equal to type vlookup you can double click select it here and you are looking for the value of team 1 so e4 comma next is table array table array is our data select the data and once you select the data this is your data you have selected the table array put a comma then column index number what are we looking for it is for file right yeah it is file so what is file file is 3 number 3 sorry number 4 file is number 4 hold on I made a mistake so the formula starts with equal to vlookup 
double click on this then the lookup value is team1 comma table array table array is nothing but uh, the raw data that we have the data that mean from which we have to fetch the main information so select this put a comma and the file is on number 4 put comma 4 right type 4 and the next will be range lookup so that is exact match so it will be 0 enter you can see for team 1 they have used 10,220 uh, files in a year so you can match it from here team 1 and the file were used by 1020 so I told you here you can drag to co for these values you can uh, you can see this box shape at the end of the cell you can drag it or also you can do you can just copy this value see I have copied and what you can do is you can select the whole area up till down and you can just paste once you do that you can see you have the values again if you want you can verify this let's verify for team 15 and how much file they have used team 15 has used 700 7872 files so let's check it from here yeah it's correct is it not easy it's very simple and re it really saves lots of our time so if you have any doubt about this you can comment me or if you have any queries you can also comment me i'll try to solve it so i hope you like the video guys please like and subscribe thank you